Watch this very carefully. Oh. Wow. Oh, man. Ouch, 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 ouch. That looked painful. But guess what? We are spin serve free in 2023. Hello, this is Keith Valentine, the Pickleball Pirate. Today we're going to talk about the most controversial pickleball rule change for 2023. Stay tuned. First, let's cover the five reasons for this rule change together. Number one, the original purpose was just to use the serve to begin play. Number two, most players cannot master a truly effective spin serve or even return a good spin serve. Number three, effective spin serves require more court space to allow the receiver to react. Number four, only a limited number of players have mastered this, giving them an unfair advantage. And number five, it is particularly devastating for amateurs. The pre-spin serve should be banned just like table tennis, but let's talk about the declared reasons. The first reason was the original purpose of the serve was to just get play started. And I think we can agree. The serve should not be too aggressive. That's why the serve rules are so complex. Already to mute the attacking power. So why allow loopholes? Speaking of loopholes, did you know that if you click the like button that you will win one million dollars? <laughs> just kidding. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to click the bell icon so you will know when we release more amazing content. Okay, Keith, back to you. Thanks, Keith. The second reason was the fact that most players cannot master a truly effective spin serve or return a good spin serve. The first part of it is really strange. Why something that only a few players can do should be banned? If we ban this, why not the so-called Bert? Hey, that guy is way too athletic. Bert! Illegal use of athleticism. <laughs> no, that's not the reason. But at the same time, I agree that too many people are having trouble returning it. The third reason is that effective spin serves require more court space to allow the receiver to react. I completely agree with this. When you have to guess and you do not have the space to react, it's really unfair. The fourth reason is that only a limited number of players have mastered this, giving them an unfair advantage. This advantage is not fair because the receiver can't see, especially those of us with bad eyesight. We can't tell which direction the ball is gonna go when it bounces. Ah! Now, although amateurs don't face it that often, it definitely could cause emotional distress and frustration. Hey look, that guy was a pro. Imagine if he was an amateur. He might have pulled something. I know I would have. But you know what? Don't take my opinion on it. Let's see what other people are saying about the band heard around the world. I don't like it. Let's not stunt the growth of pickleball before we know the full ramifications of a rule change. What is your opinion on the spin serve? I don't like it. I don't like it at all. It should, it should go away. The game will eventually get there to where you can hide it in such a way that you, you kind of have to guess which way it's going, which is what, what happened in table tennis. Okay, those were pretty nasty comments. So let's talk about why I believe the spin serve should be gone for good. When your opponent spins the serve with his fingers, it's really hard for you to see from 44 feet away which direction the ball is spinning, especially those of us with bad eyesight. Also, not possible for the receiver to see how much spin is produced until the ball bounces. That brings an element of guessing. Come on, Black! Come on, Black! Come on, Black! Ugh. And it brings chance into a sport that has rules that are designed to not give an advantage on the serve. So what do you think about the spin serve? Should it be banned or not? There are a lot more rule changes coming in 2023. Watch them right here.